I'm sure. Hey, Carl, very quickly, just a short period of time, half a minute or so. Uh, there's been a lot of talk lately on the Internet about Sarah Palin. There's a, gra a grassroots effort to get her somehow some some buzz in Iowa. G given this amount of time left before the caucuses, is, is there, do you hear any of that, first of all? Well, listen, there's cocktail circuit conversations and sort of parlor whispering in Iowa, in Manchester, New Hampshire, Columbia, South Carolina, and on K Street in Washington, D.C. Lots of Republicans still hoping that maybe somebody's going to come off the bench and run. But now, with well, a week before the caucuses and the process starting, we've already seen the problems that late entries into the field have suffered with their inability to get into the rhythm of this campaign, their inability sometimes to just manage their own rhetoric and their own personal histories in a way that's really uh, sellable to the voting audience across the country. To try to get in into the middle of the stream now that the marathon has actually begun, very, very difficult. And frankly, all, right. all of those candidates who've said no to this point, it would be very hard to imagine it. But Republicans all over this state and all over the campaign trail are still hoping against hope that that happens.